Saturn Business is the Treasurer's Report. Uh, we're working with APM at this time to uh, consolidate and get all the money finalized from uh, Associa and uh, from the banks. We, we did change banks. Uh, we're no longer using Banco Popular. I would like to add to that because we were given a delinquency report. Um, there are approximately 44 members that have small balances that are either uh, current due or over 30 days due. And since this was just a turnover report, we don't have the accurate information on who is plus 30 or greater. Um, okay, we, to be able to have a special membership meeting, we are required to have a quorum. Since the suspension That's of the right. rights did not occur uh, until tonight, those people are part of the quorum for, or part of the membership to establish quorum. That means we have to have 118 households represented in this room. And it does not appear as though we have enough for quorum. Point of order. Um. We've just had a count, and there are how many people do we have in by proxy and in person? How many do we have? Sixty-two. Sixty-two. In order to have a quorum for purposes of the meeting, there are thirty Ask him to cite of the section voters of the law. needed either in person or by proxy. So that would be a hundred and nine votes. We are nowhere near that. Ask him so specifically result, what section of the law requires a quorum. Here this afternoon because we do not have a quorum. Okay, uh, concerning the treasurer's report, we're still working with uh, APM to get a uh, financial. We're running into some uh, difficulties because uh, Socia has uh, been slow in uh, providing the numbers that we need. Um, we've been in constant contact with Socia to try to uh, get what is missing so we can get the end of year report done for 2014. We have been in discussions with the auditor. Uh, he's given us a list of items that he needs uh, to be able to complete the 2014 audit. So we are moving forward with that. Uh, as of right now, we, over, we have uh, $97,000 in the operating budget. I'm not sure of how much we have in outstanding uh, uh, accounts at this time. Um, as far as our accounts receivable, there's quite a few people that were sent late. Yes, we, we, we waived the late fees for uh, January, uh, the first quarter's maintenance fees because of uh, the change of management companies and any confusion that may have uh, occurred because of that. And in addition to that, Bruce, I found out today that if in error people sent their checks to Associa, they did deposit them. So once we have access to all the records from Associa, there's going to be some people that truly are not late. Their checks were deposited in the bank of Okay. And those will be collected accordingly. I would like to make a suggestion that we entertain having our attorney address this issue because they're supposed to turn over records right away. So I would suggest that we have an attorney letter sent to Associa to respond and to provide all of the documents because it's my understanding we're missing all of the financial reports or most of them for 2014. And if you want that in a motion, then I so motion. Second. 